So earlier today I was working on a video in Caden Live and I wanted to fade between two clips. And as it ends up, that's not the most intuitive thing in the world. So I thought I'd go ahead and make today's video to show you how exactly you fade between two clips since it's not the most intuitive thing. So as you can see, I've got this video here on my timeline and there's a cut in the middle of it. And what I wanna do is go ahead and fade between these two clips. Now. In most video editors, you would drag those clips together and then you would get the fade. Some video editors also have it under the effects category, I believe, but Caden Live does not. So in order to make the transition here, you need to go ahead and click on the clip that we're gonna be transitioning to, move it up above the other clip on the timeline, and then go ahead and drag it over the clip that you're transitioning from. Once you've gone ahead and done this, you need to mouse over to the bottom left corner of the clip and there you will see a purple button. Go ahead and click it and then you have your white. And at this point, you're free to adjust how long the white will take. You can also move the clip around to make the wipe shorter or longer. And you know, you can do pretty much whatever you want with it. Now by default, this will be a wipe, but you can actually change it to pretty much whatever you want. So with that done, let's go ahead and see what this looks like. So as you can see, it does fade into our blurred clip, which is exactly what we want, and it does look good. But let's say we want something else. Let's say we wanna make a slide. Well, all we need to do is click that, and if we go ahead and play it back again, you can see that we have quite a different effect. So with that said, that's it for today's video. I hope it helped you on your Caden Live journey, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.